Shane, Warren Gatlin gave it a better seven out of 10. How would you rank what you saw this evening? Yeah, it's difficult to, to get much above a seven with that type of opposition. So when we're looking at traits that um, that that are coming through in the Lions play, I think it's important to see how they will work uh, potentially against the spring box. And, and there was three things overall that I noticed that I think were, you know, make me optimistic about the way the Lions are setting themselves up and potential success against the Springboks. The first one was uh, that second wave attack that England deploy a lot with Farrell at 12. It's a very Farrell-centric uh, type of play, but that allows opposition to get around a blitz defence that the Springboks employ. Now, we don't know if that's just because Farrell's playing and we don't know if Farrell is going to play um, in the Test Series, but you know, if he does, and if they do, that's a it's a very positive way of attacking. The second was the Lions really went after the opposition uh, in set piece, and again, I think that's very positive. The um, Springboks uh, defensive line in multi phase is very aggressive. They get huge numbers in, and they're very we, we know how powerful they are in the tactical tackle. But in a set piece, from set piece, you've either got eight men in a line out or eight men uh, in a scrum, and that means there's a lot more space. And you know, traditionally, Irish teams, for example, have had great success against the Springboks when going after them from set piece. We saw that today. And then finally, um, we saw the line outs going to the back of the line out, a lot of throws going to the back of the line out. Jamie George had a really good game today, right across uh, the board in um, in set piece particular. And when um, teams go to the back of the line, it cuts off those two shooters off the back of the line in defence. So it means there's less people in the midfield, but it also allows um, two passes to get very wide and makes difficult for that blitz defence that we see uh, the Springboks employ to get up into the passing channels and makes it easier for the opponents to get around them. So they were kind of three of the big traits that I, I think we saw um, from the Lions and hopefully that's a build week in, week out uh, towards that uh, first um, test game.